Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. It feels like forever since I've actually talked to you because um, yeah, the whole like moving process was such like a big to do. Larry has entered the building. <laughs> but it almost just feels like I don't even know how to vlog anymore. But Today we are just going to be doing like a really productive day in my life. I just put on makeup except for eye makeup. I have to film a video today and I know that every time I vlog I'm so much more productive than when I'm not vlogging so that is why we are doing that. I have to tidy up the house. It has gotten quite a bit messy and um, prep for my mom and sister to come and visit because they are coming to visit and we are going to Disney and I can say this because by the time you're seeing this it's already happened but my sister is getting engaged this weekend in front of Cinderella's castle. So a lot of prep work has been going into that. Yeah, that's what we are doing today. So hi, if you are new here, my name is Caitlin. I make magical lifestyle videos and I live in Orlando, Florida. So if you like lifestyle, fashion, beauty, travel when we can, <laughs> um, but also Disney, this is a great channel for you to be on. Please hit that subscribe button, ring the notification bell. I post on Tuesdays and Fridays. Also, follow me on Instagram. You can get a look at my day-to-day -day life. Go on my Instagram so you can see everything that I get up to this week and my sister's engagement. I need to make a highlight for Disney on Instagram. So that will be there. So go follow me. Also, if you really do love Disney and Harry Potter and like theme park content and stuff like that, uh, I have a podcast with my best friend. We took the month of February off because we both moved to Orlando, but come March, we are in full swing. We have our podcast on all platforms where you listen to your podcasts, and we are also launching our YouTube channel. So all of season two of our podcast will be on the YouTube channel, and then all of season one is already up and wherever you listen to your mod podcasts. So, yes, let's get started for the day. I need to do several tidying. I really need to film that video. So, Maybe I will work on that first and do that before I start the washer and dryer because then it won't be in the background. It's a brilliant idea. Um, and then my best friend that I mentioned, Sarah Beth, who does the podcast with me, they are actually moving tonight. So they will, they drove from New York City to Orlando. So they will be here around five, six ish. So we need to go to Target and hopefully Urban Outfitters. Maybe I can convince John to finish work a little early today. Um, and then we are going to go to their house and like order takeout and have a fun night and be super excited that we finally both live here. So really quickly, I just wanted to come on here because I was putting my slippers on and I wanted to show you my new slippers. <laughs> They're so cute. They are like the Ugg Fluff Yeah slippers. I didn't know how I feel about them because they're platformed, but their grips are super amazing. That had a big hair on it and that flew in my face and that was not fun to have happen to me. Their grips are super strong. Uh, you like are not going to slide in these whatsoever and they're really soft. So they're super cute. If you were thinking about getting them like I was for the longest time, let this be your sign. Get these slippers. They're worth the investment and it's quite an investment, but I love them. They've like, I've had them for only like a week and they've already conformed to my feet. They're so nice. Hello, Mr. Business Owner. What's up? How's the day in the office? It's going. You and your coworker, Rue, are getting along quite nicely, I see. <laughs> this is like everyone's dream job is to work like this. It is the life. John works in the guest bed, so he doesn't work where he sleeps. <laughs> and I think that's so funny. And then my new desk chair came in. It's so cute. It's like a little seashell. And I see some paw prints, so somebody must be getting into it. Mm-hmm. Yep, I see you. You can't hide from me. But 
I also want to show you this super cute t-shirt I got for Brooke. I'm going to hide it in my park bag and let her change into it so she can wear it the rest of the day. And then she's got something like super cute to have a memory of when she got engaged. So I will leave the Etsy shop down below. It's like jun Junto Designs, Punto Designs, something like that. I'll leave it. Uh-huh. I see you. Do you like the chair? Oh, that's sad. That's a sad story. That's what I got her. I need to like clean this room and prepare it for my mother and sister to arrive because this is where they're staying. Okay. And I also need to, whoa, you just left. <laughs> I also need to pick out my stuff for Disney. Hey, John, what would you say? <laughs> what would you say to us maybe finishing work a little early today and going to Target? I would say I should have known about that before I scheduled the three. Oh, no. <laughs> but after four, I can. Okay. That's kind of early. It's like an hour early. Um, can we also go to Urban Outfitters? Thank you, love you. I just finished prepping for the video that I have to film. I'm going to use, it's a um, three looks, one palette video. And I'm going to use this Too Faced Pretty Rich palette that Brooke gave me for Christmas. So she gave me several palettes, so I'm really excited to have some new ones to like kind of dabble in. But I did want to show you, I don't know what exactly I can say. I definitely need to cover up my address. But... I wanted to show you that we got our Florida license yesterday and it's so cute. It's like the most colorful license ever. And it also says that I'm a safe driver. <laughs> I don't know how they know that, but they do, I guess. So the picture, she's not that cute, but between like trying to look okay and taking off your mask and then they had the camera at like a weird angle because it has to be like socially distanced now. I don't know. It was weird. So yeah, but she's, she's cute. They also have this weird thing where, like, you have, like, your big picture, like, normal, and then down at the corner, they have, like, a tiny picture. Do you see it? It's, like, in, like, this halo, and it's transparent. It's so weird. Very excited for this little guy. This guy is my ticket to a Disney annual pass Florida resident discount when they open it back up to being purchased again. So excited that I have those. Well, not those. Excited that we have them because John got them as well. I'm going to catch up on some emails and then Jonathan and I are going to make tacos. I'm probably going to film after I eat just so that's all good. So I'm going to tidy and stuff before John is ready to stop for lurch ironically john you're wearing taco socks yeah because it's taco friday <laughs> it's taco friday blurry you're so pretty who made you this pretty huh who made you this pretty was it god and jesus and chuckles you're so handsome with your fancy pose Oh, oh, thank you, Blair. <laughs> thank you. I wanted to show you guys these cute ears that I picked up Brooke for the trip. So this trip, honestly, was to celebrate her graduation. But then Blake decided he wanted to propose, so now it's kind of a both. 
but I got her. It says class of 2021 on it. And then it's a little graduation. So I'm going to cut the tag off and that tag and have it waiting for her. I need to tackle this mess of a kitchen and clothes and just kind of tidy up everything. Um, I mentioned in my intro that Jonathan and I um, both were not feeling very well in the last like week and a half. And I think what happened to us was that we had so much going on between the move and just everything with that and how it happened and how quickly it all happened and the three day drive <laughs> that once we like finally like stopped that our bodies just like shut down and needed a break. So he had a cold last week. I had a cold this week. I'm like still coming off of it. Our house just got in disarray. So I just need to clean my house before my mom and my sister come over. So that's what I'm gonna, I'm just gonna like tidy up everything until John's ready to cook some tacos. Hey Siri, pause the music. The tacos were absolutely delicious. Uh, we had some leftovers, so I just tidied that up. I need to like wipe down the countertops, but I'll do that in a second when I clean everything. But I need to turn on the washer and dryer, start getting that going so I can wash the sheets for mom and Brooke's bed. So they have nice, fresh, clean sheets. Um, Sven, our Roomba, vacuumed today. So that's pretty much taken care of, but I might just do an extra round everywhere. <laughs> I'm on the ground because Blair it is the rolliest of the polies, and now she won't do anything because you're here. <laughs> pretty for my background of my makeup video made myself a cup of coffee in my Hermione mug this is the first cup of coffee I actually drank in like five days because I haven't been feeling well and so I've been trying to like rest and sleep a lot more just to kind of like give my body what it needed so I was like, what's the point in drinking coffee to have caffeine to keep me awake if I'm trying to sleep and get rest? So, yeah, I just 
needed this boost though because I need to get this filming done. I need to edit this video. Sarah and Tyler are going to come. We're going to help them unload. And tomorrow I have like a chill morning, but tomorrow night we're going to Disney Springs to eat at homecoming with Sarah and Tyler because I got a reservation for me, mom, and Brooke, and then their plane got delayed. So they don't get in until like late tomorrow night. So I didn't want to give up the reservation because we love homecoming so much. So Sarah and Tyler took it. So we're going to do that. And then I picked mom and Brooke up. So I need, I need this to get all of the work that I need to get done, done. Also, I need to check before I do this on my my Etsy order. I ordered me and Brooke really cute Valentine's Day shirts for us to wear. One, because I love being festive and on theme and I've never been to Disney on Valentine's. But two, because I wanted a way to make sure I knew what Brooke was wearing so I knew exactly like if she would be cute to be photographed in or not so that's what I did so I ordered okay wait so the Justin Gage shirt that I showed y'all this one right here it's the OG like Disney logo except the thing the like little rainbow that goes around it is a diamond ring and it says just engaged that is from a shop called Punto Design. So I was close. P-U-N-T-O. Punto Design. And they have like really cute designs. They're from Jacksonville, Florida. And then I got other Etsy shirts from Magic and Mimosas. That's what the shop is called. They're in Washington State. So no wonder that one came in super quick, and this is taking a little bit of time, but I paid for rush shipping, and it said expected delivery the 10th through the 11th, so I haven't gotten it yet. It arrived today at 10 a.m. in Orlando at the distribution center. Hopefully I get it today. I should get it tomorrow, though, so that works out. I'm really hoping it comes in on time. If it's not, I'm gonna be a little salty because I paid a lot for them to get here um, before Valentine's Day. Because my soon to be brother in law waited till the last minute to decide to do this. So we only had like a week and a half to plan all of this. So, um,. Yeah, it's been eventful to say the least, but I need to set up my camera and film and then I'm going to edit. I needed to go to Target and Urban Outfitters, but Jonathan and I were just talking about it. I only need home stuff from Urban Outfitters. I needed um, a shower curtain that I've been wanting and some bath mats. And we've been waiting to like purchase new stuff that we didn't necessarily need right away until the house closed, which the house is closing today. Thank goodness. We were supposed to close two days ago, but some drama happened. I was like, we don't need stuff in the guest bathroom because we're not using it. And if we are, we're taking a bath. So we don't need like a shower curtain and stuff. But now that my mom and sister are coming, um... I thought I was going to be able to close the house at the beginning of the week and have enough time to like get the shower curtain for them, but that did not happen. So I was hoping that our Urban Outfitters store would have the shower curtain. Their website doesn't give me the option to like see if my store is carrying the item. So we might just get like a plastic one and a cheap mat or whatever from Target just so they can have something.
now I'm just gonna film really quick and let that be another thing I check off my to-do list I had a phone call with my mom and Hillary our um, travel agent to um, finalize kind of like what we're telling Brooke and how we're gonna get Blake in the park and stuff like that because he's not originally coming with us so Brooke doesn't even know that he's gonna be here much less propose to her so had a big call with that and then John and I talked about what universal annual passes we want because Hillary can book those for us as well so if you don't listen to our podcast we interviewed Hillary my friend Hillary we grew up together. She is a Disney travel agent and her services are free. So it's free, completely free to book with her. Sarah Beth is actually in the process of getting certified to do this as well. So this is my first time ever using a travel agent for anything to do with Disney. Typically I just book for myself. Uh, it's so worth it. And I probably will use Sarah and Hillary in the future because it's so easy to just have somebody else do all of this for you so if you're interested in learning about what that is what they do um well what hillary does what sarah will do in the future uh we have an episode with her so go listen to that on our podcast and then she also has a youtube channel so it's called a spoonful of mickey she makes super cute content but yeah definitely go check her out I'm gonna film this video really quick and stop avoiding it. All right, here is a sneak peek of the makeup look I filmed. This um, was like the first makeup film I filmed, makeup look I filmed in a long time. And also the first makeup look, like true smoky eye look that I did since probably like Christmas day. Uh, I feel clutch. This palette is so much fun. It's such a good palette. So if you are on the market for a cute palette, I'll show you what it looks like on the inside. I don't know if I've showed the vlog yet, but it's a gorgeous palette, like very rich tones, which is why they call it pretty rich. So I'm going to disassemble my makeup set. First time filming a sit down video here on my new set. Um, it looks rough because it's not set up yet but yeah that's what I'm gonna do and then I'm gonna edit this video fire in my head Small can out the truth There's a ghost in the room A river running through Dividing up the night Oh, mysterious way We give and we take Holding it back All we want to say Holding out a lie Reflecting your to Urban Outfitters, both of our first time in the Mall at Millennia, and that is a mighty impressive mall. If you've never been, and you're in the Orlando area, and you're like, what should I do? Very, very impressive. A lot of high-end shopping, so that's fun. But the Urban Outfitters had nothing that I needed, so, John was right. It happens. Every so, now and again. <laughs> all the time, actually. Um, and good news is that we are officially homeless. Well, if home is where the heart is, then we're good. <laughs> um, if home is where the house is, we don't have that anymore. <laughs> so, we're officially homeless. We closed on our house today. Jonathan and I did everything preemptively we signed everything and 
turned it in via mail, obviously, because we're here and we didn't want to go back just for the closing. So, so what we're going to do right now, there's a Super Target literally right next to the mall. So we're going to go to the Super Target and pick up things that I need for this week. So that's what we're gonna do for that and then we're gonna go home drop all that off I'll show you what we get and then Sarah and Tyler should be getting in in about an hour It's 630 right now. They said that their estimated arrival was 730 So we'll go pick up dinner from Huey Magoo's and eat at their new house. So we are homeless today and Sarah Beth and Tyler are homeowners as of today what what that's the circle of life people is it mm -hmm. when one house leaves another is reborn in its place no. okay welcome home millers wow look at him he is beauty he is grace <laughs> he lives here now oh, okay backing up that truck Fancy. His doesn't beef like mine did. Nope. Because <laughs> <laughs> I trust him with it. Mine had like child protection. And there's Sarah and Delta in the van. Oh, oh, okay, 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 Tyler. Straighten up, Tyler. Back it up, Terry. <laughs> Put it in reverse. Put it reverse. <laughs> <laughs> Well, he blocked this whole walkway. <laughs> That's what this little path is for. Yeah. Shaking and crying. <laughs> Shaking and crying. <laughs> oh my gosh. You, you made it. You locked us in. No, you got a little, a little path to the hedges. There was 20 million people. Traffic was Eight. so bad. I had a girl flip me off. <laughs> Good morning magical friends. It is obviously the next day. I have taken a shower and I'm eating a banana because my tummy just started rumbling. Okay, so wanted to show you a couple things because our Valentine's Day shirts did get in. Let me get those really quick. So Brooke got this cute castle shirt and then I got the snack one. Adorable. Love it so much. So, that's that. I also went to Target last night. Y'all know I needed to pick up a couple things. So, I want to show you what I got. Because I got some cute stuff. So, I got this really cute boho -y bath mat for the guest bathroom. So, I need to put that in there. And then... Urban Outfitters didn't have the shower curtain and bath mat that I wanted in the store, so I'll have to order it online. So I just picked up this um, shower liner so my family can take showers this weekend without getting water. <coughs> okay, that hit me out of nowhere. Without getting water everywhere. So that's what we're working with this week. Fun stuff that I got. Well... This is John's swim trunks because we were supposed to get in the jacuzzi at Sarah and Tyler's house last night and we got in so late. They got in so late and it was just, they were tired from driving. It was, we just didn't do it, okay? This is a towel that has Yandi on it, which is what we call Baby Yoda. Where's his head? Oh, right here. What we actually got from Target, I did not have any bathing suits, so I picked up this cute top from Target. It's like a little, like, small leopard print, I guess is what you call that, but super cute. And I got just plain black bottoms with it, with like little cutouts. Let me see that. So... Very cute. And then I got a one piece that's super pretty with like a lace detail and like a plummet neckline. And then, oh, this is the cutest thing. 
I wanted to see what Disney shirts they had and they have this one and I love it so much. It's like a play on like hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil Mickey's. I thought it was adorable. So that's what I got from Target. I feel like I didn't even clean that much yesterday. In fact, I did it. I need to do it all today. I think I'm going to stop it here. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. I want to start doing more vlogs just showing what I get up to here in Orlando. If you want to see my sister's engagement, our trip to Disney, be sure to follow me on Instagram. You'll see all of that. Thank you for watching. Comment down below if you want more day in the life vlogs, if you want more weekly vlogs, what kind of vlogs you want to see in general. Do you want to see us decorating our apartment now that we sold our house yesterday? Like Universal, I'm. we have Universal annual passes, so we can go there quite frequently now but we obviously aren't able to get Disney annual passes yet. So if you want more like Harry Potter content, different things at Universal, Mardi Gras at Universal, all that jazz, leave that in the comments down below what you wanna see and I will do that for you. I love you all so much. I'm so thankful for you. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have a magical day. That's